We are 1040 AM KGGR 106.9 FM. Autumn Cannon here with you on this great day. We're so excited. Uh, we have a visitor here with us today. So if you're watching us on social media, of course, you could see him here. But if you're listening on the air, we have the good Reverend Dr. Bishop. Bashan <laughs> Mitchell. Hello, hello. How you doing? All them titles. Jeez, I man. know, it's a whole lot of titles. You know, just yeah. pick one. These days, you just pick one and just go with it. Well, you know what? I'm going to just pick Bashan today. <laughs> You're going to pick just Bashan today? Okay, listen. We love it. We love it. We Thank love you. you. We love your music here on this station. And so we're just excited you taking the time to stop here, stop here and talk to us. So we're going to talk about your music. We yeah. also want to talk about what you are going to be here in, in the Dallas-Fort Worth area because um, yes. we want to see you. And that's going to happen on Friday, tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. So you're excited about it. And did y'all yeah. do um, the show yesterday? Yeah, we was in San Antonio last night. And for the first show, it was literally amazing. So I, I, I think it only goes up from here. So it only goes up from here. Okay, so y'all yeah. got that, you know, first show jitters out of the way and everything. So tomorrow yeah. we're going to worship. So what what can we expect to see or experience? You know what? Fred pulls together such an amazing, energetic experience. I love to see all the artists kind of interact with each other and just, you know, be nephews of Fred. You know, uh, basically we surround a, such a great sound. Uh, so expect energy, expect praise, expect worship, uh, but expect uh, unity, you know. And I think that's what really came across last night and is going to continue to come across as the weeks to come is a unified sound for worship in this in this season. How did you get involved in this with Fred? Just talk to him, you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, and I'm from Chicago. So Fred's MD is from Chicago. And we grew up together as well, Philip Easter. And basically just talking. He was like, yo, you know, Fred doing a tour. I said, tell Fred I'm going. And uh, I was just joking, right? And, uh, you know, we, we talked and um, me and Fred's brother talked and we made it happen. Um, I had the time to do it. And and I didn't know what to expect, to be honest, because I'm the, I'm the newest person to the team. You know, yeah. Anthony been there and Ty been there and everybody else. But uh, it, honestly, the same feelings I had last night, I shared with Anthony and Ty. They said, you know, we felt like that last year as well. It's almost like you're an artist and a fan at the same time. At and the same that, time. That's what it becomes, yeah. It's hard not to be. <laughs> oh, my God. When Fred started hitting those hits, after hits, after hits, after hits, it's like, oh my God, I I, I feel like a kid again. <laughs> and and I get it. You know, I share all the time for for seven years. I was his assistant as well as singing background for him. And oh, and the good. feeling, and I'll be joining you guys on tomorrow as well. But okay. the feeling is still the same. It's always <laughs> the same. Like yeah, this is it. This is it. Oh. Wow. So we're so excited about it. So as far as some of your songs, what 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 are we gonna hear? Well, uh, I'm doing a few of them. Uh, Definitely nobody greater. And I did a little smidge of the turning around. Uh, chasing after you we're opening the show with that uh greatest man which is i went and got that back because it's basically about worship and um, i did a little medley of, of songs you know from uh uh just from the, one of my other projects i had out so just kind of intermingling uh the music in in the middle of so much other great music uh but um and i'm doing a new song i got a new song out called see the goodness featuring donnie mcclurkin oh, and, yes. uh, so gonna do a, a little bit of that as well uh just just uh sharing the sound uh, it's great, you know, it's it's kind of funny because, you know, it's one thing to go to a concert and someone do, they said, and then somebody else said, but somebody else said, but it's going to be great for people to see how these songs kind of talk to each other and then talk to you and minister as well from Todd's song to me, to Jay's fortune, to uh, Anthony Brown, back to Fred. It's like, it's crazy. You know, we were there last night for a minute. It, it wasn't the venue. So the church was like, have your way. And then uh, we did. Wow, that's exciting. We're, we're excited about it. Um, I think there are going to be quite a few people there. Uh, we've been getting a lot of feedback here at the station for, um, you know, the people who are actually coming to experience this. And Fred is known for just having a lot happening on stage yeah. at the same time. We're just all so out there know. all the time. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> wow, we're excited about it. And you're definitely a perfect fit. So there y'all have it. He is bringing out the hits and it is going down. So if you want to worship, come on now. What kind of shoes should we wear? We got shouting shoes or be cute. You know, what, what should we do? Comfortable shoes. Because they were we, they was up all night last night. And I believe it only goes up, like I said before. So comfortable. Uh, you okay. may shout, you may worship, you may get on your knees, whatever. Just make sure your feet don't hurt because it's going to be a good night. Awesome. All right. We're excited about it. That's at Texas Trust on yeah. Friday, December the 1st. Make sure that you guys are there. Go ahead and get your tickets now let's talk about some of your let's talk about your new music which you mentioned that you're we get to experience 
yeah. uh, on tomorrow. Talk about this project and who did you collab with? Ah, got a new project out. It's called Bashan Mitchell Chapter X. See the goodness. Chapter X. That's my tenth live recording. See the goodness. Wow. Uh, my single. I collab with like a gospel icon, of course, Donnie McClurkin. It's entitled "See the Goodness," and this song came about after COVID, right? basically everyone was on my i know you're writing doc i know you're writing you know everything i was like nah i asked god to close my ear because i didn't want to write about what i was going through mm. I want to write about what we came out of and that's what it, and he took me to the scripture you will see the goodness of the lord in the land of the living you know yeah. and it really says i would have fainted unless i see the goodness of the lord in the land of the living so basically i would have let go i would have gave up but i saw his goodness while i lived so uh featuring donnie mcclurkin uh, Jacqueline Lacar is on the project as well. Daryl Walls is on the project. So it's not just one song. I tell everybody, like, listen, streaming, if you're going to stream it, stream more than one song uh, because uh, this music is very life changing and it's music for the now, you know, like how are we yeah. recovering, the recovery of, of what we've been through, uh, not what we're going through. So uh, I, I like to share that and I'm smiling because I had to recover. My mom had to recover. My aunties, my cousins, everyone had to recover from what we had never seen before. But God is still God. So that's what the project is about. It's out now. It's streaming everywhere. So um, check it out. And you are so anointing. Like everything you touch, everything uh, you write, it's like, you know, it's obvious that it carries the anointing. So we are definitely excited about it. You've worked with so many people. So many people have worked with you. Who is that dream person that you haven't worked with yet that you really want to? Oh my God! Um, one of probably gospel's greatest, Yolanda Adams. Oh wow! I would, I would love to write something, you know, to write just something, you know. I don't know, but we'll, we'll see what God says. That's my auntie. Oh wow! I'm call her, but she probably don't even know that. So I'm probably just start writing it and send it to her. <laughs> okay, see. well let's. I'm gonna make sure. Let's make sure we tag her so she hears it. Right, right. <laughs> to say, yeah, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, wow. We we are so excited about it. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow night at uh, the Texas Trust Theater. If you don't have your tickets, go ahead and get your tickets. It's going to be exciting. It's yes. going to be off the chain. Are y'all dancing on stage? Because sometimes it gets a little, yeah. Oh, we were definitely dancing. We were definitely dancing. You know, we got our footwork in. We were jumping all around the stage. It was good. <laughs> wow. I feel young again. That's why I was like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we are excited about it. Is there anything that you would like to leave with our listening audience to empower them. You know what? I like to tell everyone, you know, all the time, you know, one of my favorite songs that I ever wrote is that, you know, it won't always be like this. Mm. That, that concerning yeah. you. And sooner or later, we're turning your favor. The sooner or later is the best part. Is that because you don't know when God's going to do it. You don't know how he's going to do it. All you know is that he's able and he's going to do it. So just remember that and don't ever let life get you down because God is still the greatest power. Woo. You know what? I'm getting ready to clock out because that's my word for today. Mm, mm. That's it. That's God. all I need was that word for today. <laughs> well, we thank you so very much. And uh, we look forward to supporting your music even more. And um, we just love all things for Sean Mitchell. So we're excited about it. So we appreciate you. We will definitely see you on stage tomorrow night. Oh, yes. Thank you so much. Thank you.